the Mariana Trench is one of the most mysterious and unexplored places on Earth. Located in the Western Pacific Ocean, the trench is the deepest part of the ocean, with a depth of approximately 36,070 feet. It is named after the nearby Mariana Islands, and is located east of the Philippine Sea Plate. Today we will explore the deepest part of the ocean, which is the Mariana Trench. Hello guys. Welcome to our channel, you are watching Inside Story. The Mariana Trench is a subduction zone, where the Pacific Plate is slowly moving underneath the Philippine Sea Plate. This process has created a deep trench in the ocean floor, where the pressure is over 8 tons per square inch and the temperature is near freezing. Due to its extreme depth, the trench has been difficult to explore and very little is known about the organisms that live there. Despite the challenges, scientists have made remarkable discoveries in recent years, revealing some of the secrets of the Mariana Trench. One of the most significant findings was the existence of life at such extreme depth. While the environment in the trench is harsh, organisms have adapted to survive in this extreme environment. The first organisms discovered in the Mariana Trench were single cellid organisms, known as extremophiles. These organisms are able to survive in the extreme pressure and temperature conditions found in the trench. In addition to extremophiles, scientists have discovered a number of other unique species that are able to survive in the deep ocean. One of the most interesting discoveries was the existence of a new species of snailfish, which was found in the Mariana Trench in 2017. This species was named the Mariana snailfish, and it is the deepest dwelling fish ever discovered. The Mariana snailfish was found at a depth of 26,200 feet, 7,986 meters, which is almost 5 miles below the surface of the ocean. Another fascinating discovery was the existence of microbial life at the bottom of the trench. In 2012, scientists discovered microbial mats at the bottom of the trench which are made up of microorganisms that live together in a community. These mats are able to survive in the extreme pressure and temperature conditions found in the trench, and they play an important role in the ecosystem of the ocean. The Mariana Trench also contains a number of other unique geological features. One of the most interesting is the Challenger Deep, which is the deepest point in the trench. The Challenger Deep was named after the HMS Challenger, which conducted the first scientific survey of the trench in 1875. The depth of the Challenger Deep is approximately 36,070 feet, 10,994 meters, which is deeper than the height of Mount Everest. In addition to the Challenger Deep, the Mariana Trench contains a number of other deep areas, including the Sirena Deep, which is the second deepest point in the trench. The Sirena Deep was named after the scientific research vessel Sirena, which conducted a survey of the trench in 2003. Despite the many discoveries made in the Mariana Trench, there is still much to learn about this mysterious place. Scientists continue to explore the trench using a variety of methods, including remotely operated vehicles and submersibles. In 2012, film director James Cameron made a historic solo dive to the bottom of the trench in the Deep Sea Challenger submersible. Cameron's dive was the first solo dive to the bottom of the trench, and it provided scientists with valuable information about the geology and biology of the trench. The Mariana Trench is an important area for scientific research, as it provides scientists with an opportunity to study the extreme conditions that exist in the deep ocean. By studying the organisms that live in the trench, scientists can gain a better understanding of how life evolved on Earth and how life might exist on. I hope you like this video. If you do, kindly subscribe to our channel and leave a comment below. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world blind?